Hey everyone, it's me, Halise, back with another video. When I'm running and gunning for production, I like to carry my e-bags TLS Motherload Weekender instead of a traditional camera bag. There are a few features that I really enjoy about this bag. One of them being that there are a lot of different pockets and sections that allow you to be as organized as you want with this bag and carry a variety of different things. The main compartment offers two straps going across the width of the bag for strap down support and a really nifty fabric shelving system, which again makes organization a breeze and also allows you to stack things without them sliding all around the bag. A removable pouch is available as well for maybe dirty personal items and last minute belongings. It has an expandable zipper for when you really need to pack it full, adding a few extra inches as well. And finally, hidden and cushioned really well is a laptop tablet holder with pocket and straps. Now when I'm running and gunning, this is the gear I like to bring. With it, I can pretty much be a one-woman band and capture everything my heart desires while away and edit on the fly if I so choose. Links to all my gear is in the description box. First off, Jeff, my Mavic Pro drone. Essential to any trip, this drone is so portable and lightweight, it's a must. I like having a traditional tripod around, so when I need to lock off a shot, say for a time lapse, I can. Again, I keep the tripod in its pouch, so if I want to break off from my full bag, I have that capability. And speaking of time lapses, this is my Sony NEX 5T, which is now called the A5000. And I use this camera specifically for Sony's time lapse application and as a camera too if I want a second angle for an interview. For my main camera, I use the Sony A6500 and a basic lens package. I have a wide angle, mid range, and telephoto lens. I also use Rode's Video Micro when running and gunning, and I plug that directly into the camera. This all lives in my Timba carrier. I use eBags cushioned pouches for all my cabling and cords. Jeff's charging pod and power cables live in the big one. All my SD cards, camera cleaning equipment, and card readers live in the middle size one. And finally, the smaller size one holds all of my camera batteries. All right, let's pack. For the main compartment, I put Jeff, my tripod, and the biggest packing pouch. With the mesh lining, I add my larger Rode microphone that I keep with me if I want to get better sound than with the micro. For the front main pocket, I add both cameras, hard drives, and the remaining two packing cubes, and the power for my laptop. I like keeping the stuff in the front pouch so I have a quick and easy access. The top pocket fits my Joby Gorillapod really well, and of course my laptop goes in the laptop sleeve. Last but not least, I use a Z-clamp to hold my monopod alongside the backpack and secure it close by using the side's buckles. Of course, when you're running and gunning, you gotta stay hydrated. In the comments below, let me know if you want me to review this Q bottle, Quay bottle? I don't know. It was another impulse buy. And that's essentially how I pack for a run and gun shoot. Earlier this year, I used this setup to shoot for Evelyn from the internets. We spent the day in the park, so I kept everything on my back so we wouldn't have to go back and forth from a car. And it worked perfectly. Thanks for sticking around to the end of this video. I reached out to eBags and they came in clutch. I have a free Motherload Weekender convertible to give away. I made sure to ask them for the full size one since I technically own the junior size. 
because I'm petite. In order to win the bag, make sure you're following me on Instagram at Holly's Beast and comment on the picture of this bag letting me know what you plan to use it for. In about a week, if you've won, I'll slide into your Instagram DM asking where I can send you the bag. If you're interested in just purchasing the bag for yourself from eBags, a direct link is below. I'll see you when I see you.